Success that I've gotten previous in the past due to like the different programs that I've got accepted to. I plan on like after I matriculate after, um, from college and be successful on giving back to the community. Thank you very much, and I'm very proud to have this award. <laughs> Like Quali said, you know, you can take a toothpick and make the lumber yard, Kato. Well, we took this affair tonight and made it so big that we're going to do it next year in honor to have love for one another. I just really thank God for the turnout tonight, and I just thank all the people that came. It was sensational, and it was something that Quali, he's there in heaven. I believe he is. Wherever he's at, he knows he, he, he's just a legend. He's not just a memory, he's a legend. And I just want to let you all, all know that we can come together and do great things while we have the time. Because, hey, life is just for a moment. So I'm gonna close with this here. You know, one thing that we all have to do is love one another and keep the legacy going of peace, love, and equality. So, on that token right there, I'm going to say God bless you, love all of you, and y'all have a lovely, lovely next time we come together. We all put it together and know that, hey, it's, it's the unity that makes it. So, I'm closing with that. So, one love. Kill it. I say that uh, the night was a very special night, and I was uh, honored to be uh, privileged to participate in this night with the uh, with the, um, my peers you know and uh, this has gone over decades and decades I, I, I've been in Harlem for 
five, six decades, and so this is almost 60 years. And uh, it's been an honor just to be associated with Harlem. And that, so that means all the great people, especially most of them are here tonight, not most of them, but quite a few of them are here tonight. And they made such a special, special occasion tonight. And I was just happy to be able to celebrate it with my friends. And I hope we can do this again next year. And then I think next year, we'll really people uh, understand what they actually miss and they'll be more readily to uh, uh, participate in this. So I'm looking forward to it, and I'll be spreading the word, and I'll be doing my part to make it a success for next year. So I'm looking forward to it. Thank you for allowing me to participate with this. Thank you very much. Spreading the news. I'm leaving today. I want to be a part of it. New York, New York. <laughs> That's it, I can't, I can't say without the music, but thank you so much. Hi, I'm the Princess of New York City. My name is Stephanie. I just want to give a shout out to Gloria Crooks and Blood for the fabulous birthday celebration bash of the undisputed, undefeated, qualified man of the house. And we give all praises to God that is due to him. And we thank you so much for inviting us. We had such a fabulous time and we wish everybody to come out next year and celebrate with the old timers. Thank you and God bless you so much. Hello. Uh, yes, hello. I, I'm, I'm Leslie White. I'm the, uh, the uh, mayor of Harlem, the honorary mayor of Harlem. And I tell you, it's been a lovely event this evening. Just meeting some very lovely people, some very down-to-earth, serious people. And you know, we're just doing it in Harlem. That's right. Just doing it in Harlem. Peace and blessings. Thank you so much, Gloria. It was my birthday, and I celebrated it well. We are indeed family. Well, Diamond, this was a magnificent event to celebrate the old guard, the former Harlem, to bring us all together, uh, to see each other once again, and to celebrate life, and to celebrate and recognize Qualified for all he did through the music industry. And just like your name, Diamond, Harlem is also a diamond. And these were all of the different facets of that diamond were here tonight. And the one thing that I asked us to do, because when they were young, and I was a little kid, when they were dressed and they came to pick you up, they were dressed and looked good and beautiful. And that they should teach the young people today that instead of dropping their pants, that that is not a sign of respect for their mothers, for their women, for the black women of this community, but instead disrespect and teach them to pull their pants up and respect themselves, their community, their children, and the women of this great community. But Michelle Diamond, it was fabulous, just like you. Thank you.